NFL primetime, Cadillac Williams got the starting nod, as you've seen big time for Tampa Bay, but his running mate at Auburn, Ronnie Brown, his first touchdown. A little closer, the heck with the challenge. So, the touchdown is 21 to 10. Ronnie Brown, quick through the hole, Tom, it's going to be 58 yards. Yeah, that combination of speed, power, hitting the hole, we see it from Cadillac Williams, we see it from Ronnie Brown. Both of them had that exact same explosion. Plus, he started in foul ground. And, then and New this is an interesting formation in New England. Barron up front, Tom. And bang! Ronnie Brown, a touchdown. It's a 13-7 game. Yeah, Chris Chambers lined up in the backfield. You think that there's something tricky going on. The straight hand off to Ronnie Brown for the touchdown. The Dolphins are not that good, but Miami has a history with an undefeated Bears team. Sorry, Coach. Sorry. <laughs> He's upset. Hey, Jaws, how do you bust up a defense that just doesn't get busted you up? you got to have a nasty offensive line that comes out with an attitude to move people. That's what the Dolphins did. They moved the Bears. And they got Ronnie Brown running. Game for 25 there. Then the former Auburn star gets the pitch right. Oh, y'all got to give me that. 27-yard gain. Later in the drive, Ronnie's going to have another big game. But, Coach, do you want your quarterback giving up your body, or do you want him just getting out of the way? Well, I think this shows what this, this guy's all about, really. I've always liked Joy Harrington. He hasn't had the great numbers at quarterback, but he's a good blocker, and that proves it right there. Why did you start liking Joey Harrington? I've always liked Joey Harrington. I like him better than a Polish quarterback. <laughs> thing in the NFL that this fella cannot do. And where is that great Bear defense that we were compared <laughs> to the 85 Bears defense? Ronnie Brown said they live no more. No more do they live. 157 yards later on a second and one. Again, going to the running back, Ronnie Brown. We thought he'd run out of bounds, but he cuts back in, and luckily he still gets out of bounds a gain of eight. Still no score the Dolphins, but wait a minute, Chad Pennington, wide left, Ronnie Brown. No, he doesn't give it to Ricky Williams. What is this, a single wing? It's a touchdown, seven nothing Miami. Now, 7-3, Brown takes a handoff, and this is just off left tackle, Tom. 15 yards, 14-3. Yeah, th Miami. that was no single wing, no hard formation. Just drive the ball left and run over the Patriots. Now, Pennington lined up as a flanker on the right. Brown will take the snap. We're going back 40, 50 years, and he fakes again, and right up the middle. Where is everybody? I know these are wild plays, but there's nobody there. He won to six. No, this can't. Here's another one. Pennington is receiver. Brown's going to take the snap, fake the handoff. No, he's going to throw it lefty to Anthony Fasano. Are you kidding me? 28 to 6. The Dolphins all over the Patriots. And then 28 13, early fourth. This would do it. Again, the odd formation. Brown takes the snap and fakes the handoff again and bowls through the secondary. He could go all the way. 62 yards. This is the scene, early fourth quarter. The Patriot fans leaving. Tony Sperano getting the bat. It's over right now, ended in shocking fashion. Ronnie Brown did it all. He ran for four touchdowns, and he also threw a touchdown pass to Anthony Fasano. 17 carries, 113 yards for Brown. Dolphins shocked New England, and Wendy Nix has our State Farm road coverage trying to get things going and this wildcat offense Merrill it's as if nobody saw it the week ago well, first when thing, they used it against the Patriots. <laughs> Last year they defended a little better because they have some tape on it but one thing they do a great job get the quarterback put him wide where he can occupy a defender not get him involved in front of game. But one thing that you do in all seriousness is you have an extra blocker because of this you know you can fake it when a quarterback hands it off it's 10 on 11. When you snap it to a running back now you get that extra blocker and it helps but they also know how to run it well. Ronnie Brown knows how to run it well. They block well up front. And he does a great job with his patience up front. A press and a hold, Coach Ditka. Yeah, well, those are runs of 12, 4, and 9. And then once again with the Wildcat formation, Brown takes the snap and he gets a great block from Ricky Williams Good right job. there. Good job Seals out there, off Chad. the end. What are you doing out there, Chad? By the block way. Somebody. So two plays later, Chad Pennington, Dolphins take advantage. Pump, throw on move, Ronnie Brown, 39 yards. Two plays after that at second and five. Ronnie Brown avoids the tackle. Seven yards in the end zone. And with under two to go, Houston's going to lose again. It's 28. He had seven catches, 175 yards, a career high. Uh, and then the Wildcat offense. There's Ronnie Brown. There's Chad Pennington on a second and four. And Ronnie, well, Merrill, you've liked him since they took him.
Yep. You know what? I, and they keep using this wildcat. On the year, finding Ricky Williams inside the five. First down, and then Ronnie Brown taking it from there. Two yards and the score. And the Dolphins improve to 4-4. Four and four. They win it 26-17. One carry in the fourth. Dolphins down 6-0. Ronnie Brown, reservations for six. His 10th rushing touchdown, of course, from the University of Hawaii. That led to a field goal. And then Pennington pitches to Brown, who goes to throw it to Pennington. Downfield, David Martin. Martin fumbles it. Fumble recovered by the Rams. Quentin Culberson. Confusion between Pennington and Brown on that play. So the Rams, the Miami Dolphins defense stiffened and they got things going. Chad Pennington trying to avoid the pressure, flips it out to Ronnie Brown. This is why Ronnie Brown, even though with limited rushing stats on the year, made the Pro Bowl, making something out of nothing right there for the first down. Touchdown to start the day. Tiger says that's like my eagle on the ninth hole at the uh, BMW. Uh, this Wildcat thing worked the entire game, Trent. Yeah, it was wild to say. It was power football. It wasn't trickeration. You got to love the fact that they ran between the tackles with authority with it. Speaking of running with authority, Ronnie Brown, get out of my way. I am going to score. But such a patient run on the touchdown play, Trent. Really was. And like I'm talking about, power football, your back has to press the hole, be patient, and then explode through the alley like Merrill Hodge tells us he has to. Yes, Ronnie Brown averaging 5.7 yards a carry. Tony Sprano loves it. Wildcat back in effect. Trent. Now, once again, power football, nice patient run. The first power play was strong B gap. This time, Pennington to Ted Ginn, who did catch 11 balls, and it pays off here in the fourth quarter with the second touchdown. Brown had 136 yard rushing. It was a 13 play 75 yard drive that consumed eight minutes and 45 seconds. now that running game how about the wildcat and ronnie brown oh, the running back we told you on sports center the wildcat player to watch this week ronnie brown because chad was going to start wildcat's very simple we got a power they took a 10 nothing lead there brutal day for edwards not so much ronnie brown fourth and goal from the one Dolphins are up 17 to three there. And then in the fourth quarter, salting it away. Brown, 115, two touchdowns. Finns win easy. Find him a lot. Ronnie Brown would figure big for Miami. Opening drive, it's all the Wildcat formation. And for the first time all year, Ronnie Brown throws out of the Wildcat to Anthony Fasano for 21 yards. Later, more conventional through the defense. Yep, just straight power. Get movement at the line of scrimmage. Let your back get patient, find the seam, and get through it. That's nine yards, and it led to third and goal, Ronnie Brown. Same old, old-fashioned football goal line. Ronnie Brown has a great nose for the end zones, patient, and gets in there. 7-29 the break. Third quarter, Dolphins on their own 36. Ronnie Brown, the confusion and then power football up the middle. First and goal, and then to the Wildcat. Ten seconds, one timeout left. You can run it and call a timeout if you don't get in, or you can score and take the lead. Five touchdowns in the fourth quarter that changed the lead. That's only the second time in NFL history.